हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम श्वेता देश पांडे योर ब्यूटी बी एफ एफ एंड टुडे वी वॉज समथिंग वेरी एक्साइटिंग टू टॉक अबाउट एंड इट इज द मैक्स न्यू फाउंडेशन विच इज द स्टूडियो रेलियंस फाउंडेशन लुकिंग फॉर लाइक अ बिल्डेबल वेटलेस फाउंडेशन विच इज इन्फ्यूज विद द गुडनेस ऑफ अ सीरम दैन दिस फाउंडेशन इज फॉर यू गाइज दिस फाउंडेशन प्रोमिस ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स ऑफ फ्लॉलेस फिनिश एंड प्रोमिस ट्वेंटी फोर आवर हाइड्रेशन विद अ फ्लॉलेस फिनिश दैन यू गाइज आर इन द राइट प्लेस सो ऑल राइट यर्स द स्टार ऑफ द शो विच इज द मैक्स स्टूडियो रेडियंस serum powered foundation before we get into the nitty gritties of this foundation do not forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon below so whenever i post a video you guys are notified first so this is the packaging of the foundation you guys can see that it is like the typical mac cosmetics foundation comes with a pump this time because usually the mac studio fit foundation doesn't come with a pump it comes with the the lid and they ask you to buy the pump separately so mac you guys did a good job when it comes to putting a pump on the foundation and um the difference in this is that the embossing on this is in gold so it gives that very nice luxe feeling to it and a little bit of like a little bit of premiumness to the packaging so i have already primed my skin with a moisturizer and a primer i'll be mentioning the details in the caption below i picked this up in the shade nc35 and the reason why i picked this up in the shade nc35 is because i'm a warm toned person so um it's better to choose foundations which balance your undertone so i picked this up in nc so nc means natural cool or c or even if you are getting confused in what to get then make sure that you see that it's nc and not nw if you're a warm toned person and my shade number is 35 So as you can see that this foundation very effortlessly is blending onto my skin, and it's giving me that even tone right away. So Mac claims to be this foundation to be of buildable coverage. So I think pretty much we can just keep on applying it layer over layer to build your coverage and give it a full coverage look. But uh, the fact that it is a serum infused foundation this is something new that I've tried, and um, pretty much I think I'm very happy with this coverage. It looks very natural onto my skin. the foundation has a very like a very hydrating like um it has like a very hydrating texture to it like as i dripped it onto my hand it was a bit runny and watery which gave that like you know that serum infused kind of feel to it but uh, this foundation settled onto my skin very effortlessly what's great about this foundation is that it's buildable You can start with a light coverage and for a natural look, and build it up for full coverage for those special occasions. I love how it conceals my imperfections without feeling heavy on the skin. Now let's talk about the 24-hour hydration. My skin feels very hydrated right now, and it feels super lightweight. Mac really hit the mark with this one, guys. Plus, it doesn't even settle into fine lines and creases. It just evenizes your skin. and it gives that very nice healthy plump to your skin but is that it doesn't even emphasize the dry patches on your skin which is a big win in my book texture wise i think it's done an excellent job um at smoothing all my skin all over and obviously blurring out the appearance of my pores it's a very flawless canvas for you know the next steps of makeup so i'm going to do a very quick test and see if it transfers onto a tissue and i'm just going to like dab it onto my face and see if it transfers and voila only a bit of it is transferred compared to the rest of the foundation that you put on your face when you just dab tissue paper there's like a huge mark of you know that brown foundation onto your skin and this one just doesn't transfer much you guys can see the tissue paper is like pretty much white so yes it's transfer proof to some extent so it's great for those long days and nights where in you know you want something to wear long wear all right let's sum it up so the max studio radiant serum foundation is like a winner in my book i think this is going to be one of their best selling foundations and um it's buildable it's weightless and it provides 24 hour hydration and doesn't settle into any fine lines or creases and 
you know blurs up your pores so what else can you expect from a foundation perfect for those guys who are looking out to even out their skin tone and also blurring their pores and creating like a perfect canvas for their skin and uh, also achieving and also who want to achieve a radiant finish have you tried this foundation and if you guys have tried it do share your thoughts in the comments down below if you guys want me to review any product then do let me know in the comments below do not forget to give a thumbs up and share it with your makeup loving friends don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on the content that i post thanks for tuning in guys and i'll be seeing you in the next video